Hi there folks, I thought I'd drop in. I'm, what I'm basically doing is I'm preparing some different styles of glue that we use in the primitive technology arena. So um, what I'll do is I'll show you them, show you what's going into them and tell you a little bit about um, each one. So as you can see, I've got three pots going on here. I'm trying to keep the heat fairly steady because we don't want things going wrong. Um, the one that I'm quite interested in is just here. And what that is, is that's the water that was used to boil up all of the bones on the legs and so forth that I've got over there on the course I was running this weekend. And what actually happens, you can see there's a little bit of scum sitting on the top and I'll just keep clearing that. And, um, and I'm just pushing off a little bit more of the moisture that's in there. So when that actually cools down, that will set like a gelatinous lump. Um, and just prior to letting that cool down, what I'll do is I'm going to crush up some of this malachite into a fine dust and pop that into there and stir it around a bit. And that should stop it going mouldy. Then just up here, I'm getting on target. What you're looking at is you're looking at a little bit of beeswax. That's about 25% to um, to um, pine resin. So that's all sitting in there, melting down at the moment. We'll stir them together. And then I'll probably take a tablespoon of this charcoal you saw me pounding a minute ago, and I'll pop that in and then just stir that up. What that will do is that's going to give me a very reliable glue that looks good in the things that I get up to. Now just round here, one that I'm trying to take care of, this is silver birch tar. So the birch tar itself is full of actual resin and um, you can get the oil from that. What you do is you very gently and steadily keep reducing that and what you'll end up with is that, that will reduce down and that will become a glue which was um, part of part of what they were using way back in the stone age as it is it can be used for um, conditioning leather and many other little tasks like that so there you go just a short drop in show you what i'm up to first thing this morning and um i'll uh, when i get these to a further stage what i'll do is i'll stop in and i'll show you what what the results are cheers for now thanks hope you enjoyed watching